Hello everyone. Welcome to our another tutorial. Uh, on our last couple of tutorials, we have shown how to create the before after image slider and how to create before after image gallery. In this video, we will show you how to create before after image filter gallery. Um, if you haven't checked our last videos, please check those out. The link should pop up on top of this video. Uh, because you have if you don't check those this video it would be not much clear for you because we will not cover how to create the image sliders on this video we will straightly straight go to the filter gallery part now um, so first of all in order to create filterable gallery you need to make sure that um, all your sliders has enough okay, uh, specific categories selected so for example on these two sliders in it uh, we haven't selected any categories so for example let me select city and let's select hotels now after those categories are selected go to gallery generator and here you first need to select which of the categories you want to show on your front end so if you want to show all categories just select all now you need to select the columns let's skip two columns uh, by default the title and description and read more links are hidden but if you want to show just tick this one uh, and then let's create the short code so that's it now if we copy now let's create a new page filter then we publish So if we now check it out and go to the front end, you will now see all the categories are available here. If we click the categories, then the filters are now showing fine. Now um, let's say we want to, sorry, let's say we want to show specific categories, right? So you have to show city, cityscape, can club, these three categories. So ho on your keyboard, if you are on Windows, click Control, and if you are on Mac, click Command, and then click the categories you want to select, and then let's select the columns, and then sh let's shortcut. Now, if we replace our previous shortcut with this one. And if we now reload, as you see, we are, we have now we are now showing only those specific categories. So by this way, you can create separate filterable pages for each of your galleries. Um, now we also have some options panel. Sorry. So you can set the radius of these filters. So let's say I would I add five pixel. Let me say ten pixel. And you can also change the colors and backgrounds and hover colors over background, some paddings on these filters. And if you save, so let's just say the radius here. You should see the radius here now. There you go and if we add some padding let's say 50 and 50 so there is go padding so that's basically it for the filterable gallery so it's as you see it's quite easy to do so let us know if you see any issues with the filters on our comments or on our support channel thank you